Hi, my name's Alan. I was out in the barn and uh, saw the, this cover on my generator. I just got it not long ago. I wanted to show it to you. This is a wind generator that I bought oh, a good while ago, a year or more ago. And I bought this cover for it and it's just perfect. Fits just perfect on it. This is the wind, look at it, 4750, 4750 watt, 240 or 120. And uh, this uh, this cover fits perfectly on it. It it's it's a little big, so you could put a uh, a larger. I think it's uh, rated for a larger generator than this 4750. But uh, it goes on this one good. It's got drawstrings in case it's not tight enough. It is plenty tight, but in case it wasn't, you got drawstrings. I don't know whether you can see those or not. Right here, drawstrings on it where you can pull it tight at the bottom if you needed to. But just uh, man, goes over real nice protects covers all the way down to the wheels even got the even got the wind emblem on it i guess i could pull it all the way down over the wheels if i wanted to stretch it out it is like i say just it's not it's not big for this this is the one made for it but it's uh it could go a little bit larger generator. If you've got a little bit bigger generator, I bet you this would fit. This generator, the from from uh, frame to frame, is 23. So with the handle, it's more like 25. Wide, the frame is 17 and a half. We'll call it 18 inches wide at the wheels. It's 23, almost 24 wide. Really nice little cover for this, very inexpensive. So if you got a little generator, even if it's not a win, if you've got a little generator you want to cover, I would highly recommend this because it's, uh, it's heavy duty. I don't know what that is, it's not canvas, but it's really, really nice, it really is. Uh, fits great, covers it great, will protect it great, and man, if you don't have a cover on yours, you surely ought to get one, and this is a good one. I really like it, I think you're gonna like it too, and I hope that helps you.